Would it bother you to know that our local Greyhound track injects its race dogs with a drug that dozens of veterinarians feel is unethical and potentially harmful? Well, it sure bothered the city of South Tucson. That city banned the practice, but that didn't stop it, as Not On Your Side investigator Claire Dewan discovered. One, you can't read the sign. We just want to know what you guys are no, doing here. I, I, I want you to read the sign. But before we tell you why we came here to ask some tough questions and got kicked off this property, let's hit rewind. Back to where the story really starts, here at Greyhound Park in South Tucson. And they're off. It's where nearly 700 dogs race for everyday track betting and simulcasting at the only such track in Arizona. Here comes number seven. But something else is going on here that you don't know about. Something one animal rights activist feels is shady. Everybody's been turning a blind eye to this. The legislature, the city of South Tucson, the track vets, the state veterinarian. You see, the city of South Tucson passed an ordinance in 2008 making it illegal to inject female greyhounds with anabolic steroids. That's what the track did for years to stop the dogs from going into heat and getting sidelined. The track just doesn't want to make any effort to comply with the steroid law. So what did the track do instead? Well, we acted on a tip, waiting in a nondescript van with our cameras rolling, staking out a home just outside South Tucson city limits. Lo and behold, right around 6 a.m., a truck loaded with dozens of dogs arrives on this empty street. Veterinarian Dr. Joe Robinson gets to work right away, giving the injections, which are perfectly legal, in Tucson. Hi, Mr. Robinson. Private property you guys need to get off of. Can we talk to you guys about what you're doing here? Ah, uh, it's not your business. Is it ethical what you're doing right now? Yes. It is ethical? Yeah. How so? Huh? You're involving yourself in a doctor client privilege uh, performance. It's not, not your business. But some of those who are in the same business don't agree with Robinson. More than 100 local vets signed this petition to outlaw steroids in South Tucson. Tucson Councilman Steve Kazachik isn't a fan of this practice either. I think the guy's unethical. I think he's a slime bag, and I, I, I want to run him out of the state. Here's why Kazachik and other dog lovers are concerned. The medical director of the Humane Society of Southern Arizona says such steroid injections can cause serious side effects. Most commonly it can affect the liver um, and cause swelling of the liver and also hepatitis. Long term, Dr. Carter Neal says steroids can inhibit the dog's immune system or cause birth defects. After getting video of the injections, Nine on Your Side tracked down Greyhound Park's CEO, Tom Taylor. He admits the dogs were receiving steroids in Tucson that had been banned in South Tucson. You know, some people would say that by traveling, I don't know, five miles or so, um, that you're just simply skirting the law of South Tucson. I am. So you blatantly admit that? Well, yeah. I'd break the law if I did it here. Mm -hmm. But is and that... by doing it there, I'm not breaking the law. But isn't that just avoiding what the people of South Tucson want? Yeah. Probably is. You have no qualms about that? Oh, no. No, not at all. Taylor allowed our cameras to shoot the Greyhound's kennels, what he calls perfect conditions for the pooches. He insists animal rights activists are wrong in wanting Greyhounds to be treated like people. What do you say to people who are concerned about the health effects of these steroids on the dogs? There are no health effects on the steroids of the dogs as long as they're given in proper quantity. But Kazachik feels South Tucson banned these injections for a good reason. Now it's up to the city of Tucson residents and the city of Tucson uh, governing body to say it's, it's just as illegal and just as unethical in the city of Tucson. Kazachik and other activists believe anyone who thinks the steroid injections are harmless is running from the truth. Claire Duan, Kiga 9, on your side. So to be clear here, by injecting the dogs in Tucson, neither the track nor Robinson is doing anything illegal. Whether it's ethical, ethical, that is a matter of opinion. The ethical code for veterinarians calls for them to promote animal welfare and ease suffering. Along with banning the steroids in Tucson, Kazachik also wants to ban the practice in Pima County. We asked Taylor what he would do if those bans are successful. He said he would shut down the park costing 140 people their jobs.